Check out OneFIFA.com by using the link in the description down below to get yourself fast and reliable FIFA 14 coins. Also, use discount code PENGUIN5 to get yourself 5% off all your purchases. Alright guys, and welcome back to episode 2 of my Dina Tolly's Road to Retirement series. And uh, the first episode that I brought out actually did get a lot of good support from you guys. So you could keep that up by dropping a like on this video. And uh, if we hit 50 likes, that would be amazing. So uh, please do do that to show some support. But uh, yeah, for those of you that do not know, basically the aim of this series is to get Dean Atala to retire. And in order to do that, what we need to do is complete a starting eleven and substitute bench with Italian players. So uh, if you are confused by the rules, uh, either go check out the first episode or uh, check out the rules which will actually be in the link to this video. Uh, sorry, in the description to this video. But uh, in the previous episode, we managed to get ourselves uh, two 80-rated players or above in the packs that I opened. And because of that, uh, we were able to draft in two gold players of our choice for this episode. So after looking at feedback that you guys left on the previous video, uh, pretty much everyone wants me to bring in Buffon. So as you could see uh, by uh, the first clip that i shown at the start of this video, uh, I actually decided to bring in uh, Buffon and Cialini to strengthen up the defence a bit and uh, hopefully mean that we can concede less goals in this series. But anyway, going into the game, and uh, firstly, the team we come up against, in all fairness, wasn't actually that good. It had a few uh, gold players in it, which uh, of course is always a bit of a challenge, but with only 47 chemistry, uh, he really didn't play that well with his squad. Uh, nevertheless, though, he did have Hernandez up front, who of course got a lot of pace, so uh, always a tricky player to deal with on Ultimate Team. But anyway, going into a bit of gameplay, and as you can see here on the 45th minute, uh, we really were dominating this game in the first half. Uh, we did actually manage to finish after 45 minutes 3 0 up, and uh, in that period, we also missed the penalty, so it could have easily been 4. But nevertheless, uh, in the second half, we really did carry on in the same fashion, managing to get another goal with Dean Atali, which is actually a pretty decent strike from about 20 yards on the 50th minute to give us a 4-0 cushion. And by this time, to be fair, uh, we're in complete control of the game. But nevertheless, on the 75th minute, uh, a bit of stupid goalkeeping by me, actually managed to give our opponent uh, his first chance of the game, but fortunately, he managed to actually balloon it quite far wide. Then going into the 90th minute again from uh, his first corner, he managed to get himself another decent opportunity, but fortunately for us, uh, he didn't actually do anything with it, and uh, resulting in us winning the game 4-0 after full time. So because they get the three points and the win, that does mean we're able to open uh, three goal packs in our pack opening. I remember inside these packs, we are looking for 80 rated players or above in order to draft in any Italian players of our choice for the next episode. But anyway guys, uh, in this first pack, unfortunately we didn't manage to get ourselves uh, any players worth value to us in this series. But in the second one, we actually did manage to get ourselves an 84 rated player, meaning for the next episode we can draft in one player of our choice. Then also, a bit of a spoiler, in the final pack, uh, we didn't manage to get anyone uh, worth value or 80 rated. So unfortunately that does mean for the next episode we can only draft in one player. But uh, anyway guys, unfortunately that does bring us up to the end of this video. One thing I do want to say though is that if you did enjoy it, please do leave a like. It shows a lot of sport to me. Uh, also make sure you do subscribe to this channel for more FIFA 14 videos. And don't forget to comment in the comment section down below what Italian player you want me to draft in for the next episode.